Hey guys, what's going on? It's your boy Worst Effin Gamer, and I'm back again with another Soul Hunters Awakening video. And today we're gonna do uh, Cigars Awakening. So as you can see, what we have to do first is claim his first Awakening item, as always. And I'm almost there. I only need one more, so all I have to do is just reset this one time, and bam, there it is. Now we craft this first original item, the Lightning Core, and then the, those are the other, you know, other things you need. Let's equip. And boom! First quest is complete. Let's complete this. Second quest, Bountiful Caverns. Alright, so we're gonna have to do the Bountiful Caverns six times, which is gonna take like three days. So let's select the Nightmare difficulty here and see what a team I'm gonna use for this one. Now, normally I like to use an AoE type of team uh, for these uh, caverns here. So let's go with Fallen, Leia. I'm gonna go... Xanos, Tanya, and my last but not least is, I don't know, where should it be? I guess I can do some type of a magic. Let's go with, oh, I already got enough. All right, that's enough. Let's go. All right, so at level 97, this one is actually not difficult at all, so I got no problems with it. I can kind of just auto fight this, but I'm not. I'm going to save all my ultimates till the end and give them a big ass whooping Woo! except Tanya Tanya I'm gonna use right away cuz she can regain her uh, energy fairly quick cuz she's gonna be taking out a lot of people really easily here especially the Lee twins take them out go BAM oh Jesus come on Tanya there we go they're done now if you notice cigars got a lot of pretty nifty abilities here guys if you miss the spotlight uh, he's pretty cool because one he'll knock the tank into the back well, That's one good thing uh, That swerving revolving. Let me just do all my ultimates here all ultimates check out cigars ultimate here It's gonna do a lightning bolt boom a ton of damage and pretty much Hit paralyze everybody else. So that's circular uh, Beam or whatever you want to call that That's pretty much reducing everybody's magic attack and attack speed and all that stuff. So that's pretty good and there it is, very simple, that one is complete. Alright, so Awakening Quest, part number 2 is complete, let's accept that one now. And we're on to part number 3 and the final step of his Awakening is... Heroic Mode without him or any of his teammates being killed in action. Alright, so let's go right into that guys, so now everybody's gonna survive. Fairly simple task here at this point of the game, so let's see, who am I gonna use here? Let's go with Dokras, because Dokras... Can't possibly die because he's always in the back. Dokras is awakening. If you guys don't already know, awakening Dokras means that he's chilling in the back. He's not even out in the fight. I'm going to use, no, not Ariel. I'm going to go with Jasmine for a little bit of support here. And I'm thinking maybe go with Leia. Maybe not. Fallen. Yeah, two tanks. Let's go with a dual tank here and see how this one works out. Should be fairly simple, unless, oh, it's a physical immunity here, so that's going to be not good. It's going to probably take a while to take this guy out, even though I should take him out, but there it is. There's what I'm talking about, Cigar's uh, ability there to knock that dragon into the back, opening the doorway for me to take out those uh, other heroes there, so that's good. Now let's go Cigar Ultimate. Because this is a magic attack, so this is going to be good. Because it actually affects him, but not by much, though. Damn it. It's going to take a while here. I'm going to go with Dokras Awakening as well here. I'm going to need some extra damage here. Boom! Still not enough. Let's hope that we don't have to face this guy in the part two or three of the stages. Not that he's hard. It's just I brought... Um, I guess I brought more... I kind of brought both physical and magic, but... There it is. Not enough strong magic. Hello. Emma? Who's being? No. Ma, I'm post them. I'm recording. We're going to miss recording. Okay, after we're going to miss Why? You only have Nesser all day over there. 
gut, ne? No, he's a go-kart, he's a fucking owl all night, that's why. Alright, so part number two, stage two here. I'm gonna go with all my ultimates here. There's no reason to kind of hold them off here because this one is gonna take a while. Magic immunity. I kind of would prefer magic immunity better than the, I mean, the physical one, so that's okay. Because Stalin and the Amtar, bam, take them out quick. Alright, so very simple, easy one. Last one. Let's take this out fast here and finally get Cigar Awakened. Whoop, whoop. Let's go, go. I'll use all these. Sure. And these two right here to interrupt and we're good to go. Ha <laughs> ha. That's it. Yes. There it is. Okay. Three star stage. Let's accept. Go back here now. Woo! -hoo! Complete now. There he is! Let's check him out. Whoa! Look at this! This guy completely changed. I mean, I must say, I don't like that wardrobe change. What the hell? He's all red. Damn it all. I don't like the redness, but check him out. He's chilling there with his uh, little dragon. <laughs> eating popcorn. Yelling at the TV. Uh, I like his new hairdo, though. Whoa, he looks a lot cooler in this artwork, though. Why didn't he look like that? Why the hell did he have pajamas on? I don't know why, but the lightning god all of a sudden is a lot more godier and stronger. Woo, let's go now. And we're going to check out his um his new awakened ability and uh, enhance that a little bit. Boy, I like that new skin. It's a lot cooler. Okay, let's go. Abilities. Static shock. Let's read a little bit one more time. What is this? After... His awakening, Cigar basic attack will deal AoE damage. Enemies struck by his uh, basic attack also have a risk of receiving a static shock, which lowers their physical and magic armor. Nice! So basic attacks deal a base of 975 damage. Static shock reduces physical armor by 65 and magic armor by 65. So let's go up by this now. I'm gonna go all the way here. 20. Perfect. So we're at 21 now. All of a sudden it jumped up to 1285 reduced armor. Not bad, not bad at all, Cigar, so let's go now. First off, I want to do one thing. Let's do this first. I'm going to enchant a little bit of his Awakening, not much. Because right now, Cigar, I'm not really using until I get him to orange plus two. So I guess I can give him all these, all these, and all of these. That should be good. Let's enchant all that. That's three stars. And also, let's go into the forge. Let's, oh, there's the awakening list here. It's getting bigger and bigger. Cigar here. And I'm going to auto forge this guy now. 10, 50 times. Yep, all the way 50 times. Make sure to press all these to only get positive uh, stats here. And let's start. So let's see how much more I can um, further, further enhance his awakening item here. So this should be pretty cool here. Alright, so, so far it's looking good. We're in the teens. Oh, that was a negative. That's not good. Alright, so, you start getting into negative numbers here. Okay, we're still looking good. Actually, it's not bad. 45, 46, 7, and final. That's it. Alright, so, magic attack 22, magic armor 29, and 23 for physical armor. So, he got a little bit stronger now. And I want to take him out on a little one more test drive here. One more fight. To show you guys now that he's awakened. So you can kind of see him before and after. I guess we can go into this stage here. Chapter 14. It's a pretty good stage to test him out here. So let's take everybody out here. And I'm going to go with Cigar. And the tank I'm going to go again is Leon. Same as before. So let's check it out now. I'm curious to see his basic attacks here, because I know they're AoE now, so they should pretty much hit everybody. All right, so it did. Boom, the slow. This gets everybody slow here. That's the knockback, hitting somebody in the back. That's the plus and minus. All right, so this guy seems like a really nice support backline hero, and I'm loving me some cigar here. Boom, go, baby, go. 
But this tough... Oh, he died. This stage is pretty tough. They're even taking out Leon here, so... Probably too hard. Alright, go back. But... All in all, I'm loving me some Cigar Ultimate Awakening here, and... Um, as you can see, I'm slowly working on him, not as much as the other guys right now, because he's only three stars, but I do love me some cigars in the morning, and I love to... Where the hell is he? There he is. And I still feel like this guy is going to be a nice addition to the team as soon as I can get him up to par, use him in the back for some support, for some knockback, so he's going to be pretty cool, all right? So I'm going to end this off here, guys. I hope you enjoy. I'll see you guys next time on another Soul Hunters Awakening. Till then, have a good morning, good afternoon, and good night.